about everything. Okay, lobby or party? Yeah, you got the lobby? Yeah. Okay, thank you. So I do have a friend that stay up here and I know he be sick of me like every time I come up here I'll be like um I hear him like hey Tony I'm on the way up and he be, it's always hit or miss because I'll be like oh I have some downtime we can come and then last time I got too lit and I'll Hi, my name is Brittany, and I typically go by Brit Blue. That's my nickname. Most people call me Brit, whatever. Um, I'm a mommy. I'm a single mom. I am working a nine to five. I work in corporate, and I like to create. I love to create. Like I model, I DIY. I am Brenda the Builder. I put it together. Um. I like coming up with like creative concepts for a lot of my photo shoots. Um, follow me on Instagram. Uh, but a lot of my photo shoots, um, I usually come up with a lot of the concepts that I send to my photographer. I have a background in cosmetology. So I, I was behind a chair for some time. And I also used to do free, I used to freelance doing makeup and brow services. Today, I plan on. I'm working on my lunch break. I'm going to go to Target. I want to find something to wear tonight. I was trying to look into some of what I got already. But I don't know. I can't. I don't know. And I, and also, um, so tomorrow, we'll get into tomorrow, tomorrow. But today, the plan is uh, find me an outfit to wear tonight. Um, I'm going out of town this weekend. So I want to find... I have like one or two pieces, so I need to find something to go. I ain't even packed yet for what I, it's only like two nights, but still, I usually have like my outfits together. So I don't know. I'm not going to be able to stay in Target long because I'm just running in for my lunch break, but I do. I definitely want to get something to wear for tonight. And hopefully, 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 hopefully I can find something to wear this weekend. So, yeah, it's going to be a lot going on. Anyway, that's enough chat. And I, I'm being a chatty patty. I just wanted to kind of get in here and talk to y'all because um, throughout the rest of the vlog, I'm probably not going to be talking as much. You're probably going to be seeing me in action because it's giving baby mama on the loose. Baby mama is free to get out here and live her life for a little bit. OK, and it's the summertime. But, like this, this happened perfect timing. So anyway. I will be back and check in with you guys later. Mm, I'm so happy, y'all. I'm so glad to be doing this. <laughs> All right, y'all. I'm in the party dressing room. I was having a little bit of, um, not technical difficulties, but user difficulties. But these are the outfits I got, y'all. I forgot. Y'all, I got to remember. Y'all got to be like, Britt, pick up your camera. Pick up your phone, because what are you doing? But yeah, I got this top, these two tops, and this little dress. And then it, it's raining, y'all. So the, okay, it's dry. Is it dry? It was a big little wet spot on the dress. So, hold on. Is it still there? Because I was like, I'm about to go find me a different one. Okay, yep. So, hold on. Cold, please. So, this little crop top, you see it? Mm-hmm. This dress, oh my god, I actually saw this dress. I saw this dress um yesterday. Yeah, when I was in here getting my daughter to suffer, and I didn't have time to try it on, but it's cute, y'all. I done mess, you know, they got little towels in the back. I'm gonna decide I'm gonna wear this tonight, or I'm gonna save this for a night out in Charlotte. Cause the festival, you know, I'm not gonna wear nothing like this. I'm gonna wear like my denim skirt, and I think with my skirt, I'm up here this top with my skirt. I'm going to show y'all the skirt when I get back home. Or I'm thinking about or I'm thinking about pairing it with this top. So I think I got options. So hopefully I'll be a little self-conscious about the crop tops because my, my tummy ain't what it used to be for a long time. But anyway, your girl is stepping out of our conference zone. 
So yeah, I think I got my pieces. I really just need to like add on pieces. And then like, I gotta decide like, I think I dress this for tonight. I think I should wear the dress tonight. Yes. But I'm going to browse around a little bit more. Those things I just decided not to go with. Yeah, it wasn't fitting. The body ain't body in the way I needed to be to wear that. But anyway, so let me get out of here. Oh, it's so weird talking to yourself in public. All right, bye, y'all. Well, so I am dressed. I got to wear this out because this dress y'all saw I got earlier, it ties in the back. So I'm gonna have, I'm gonna head it over to my friend Amber's now. Um, our reservations are at seven, and look at me ahead of schedule. Look, um, our goal is to leave at six fifteen, so it's like almost six o'clock, like a couple minutes to six. Um, I just had one to talk to y'all real quick because like I felt like your girl got busy, and then ended up taking a nap, and yeah. So anyway, I'm gonna get like some full video for y'all of the whole fit. Right now, my boobies about to pop out on the side. So, but get into this beat. I don't know if the light is giving what, but I beat. gratification yes. just because the way social media is but or they want to be in your position like you want right. to be the boss but i'm like baby you don't know what this is oh costs. yeah right oh, hey y'all so your girl is on uh, how long y'all i'm on the i am on the struggle bus okay um i couldn't even talk to y'all this morning i was i had plans like oh, i'm gonna wake up and talk to them and Baby, when I tell you, it took me everything. Like, I'm still out of it. Your girl don't be hanging like that. And I definitely don't be drinking like that no more. And like, yeah, the tequila was tequilin'. 
and I was feeling it. I, I'm just feeling like myself. So I just left my nail appointment. Oh, she's so sweet. Shout out to Nailed by Geo. So sweet. But yeah, um, so I just, that's what you just saw me doing or whatever. And I really like me now. I see like, yeah. Mm, so pretty. She did so good. So yeah, like, so I'm supposed to be going to get my toes done. So I'm going to a different shop to get my feet done. So yeah, I'm about to actually grab me something to eat. Um, it's this, I used to live in this area a couple years ago, like near this area. So when I'm here, I like to like get the food I used to get. But anyway, I'm about to get me some Jamaican food. I'm I'm seriously probably about to just eat it in here, honestly, because usually people don't really be eating in here. But I'm about to eat in here today. Cause like when I tell you, I'm just all over the place. I'm like I'm running off adrenaline still, just the excitement of being on myself. And yep, so today y'all we go to Charlotte. Um, checking for Airbnb is four o'clock. I don't even know what time I plan on leaving. I still have to pack and I gotta do a couple things before I go. So got my nails done, check. I'm about to get me some food. I gotta use the bathroom. And then I need to um then I'm gonna go uh eat and then I'm gonna go get my feet done. So it's eleven forty six now. We still pretty good on time. Um yeah. I'm all over the place. But I don't pull it again. Just wanted to check in with y'all. to a camera to people that I don't know is actually listening but um made it to the Airbnb that was yeah it was a lot getting here but I made it and um I met one of the ladies that I'm gonna be staying with this weekend it's gonna be three of us um her name is Amen she's really cool meet y'all later but let me show y'all y'all wanna see because I ain't never did an Airbnb I ain't even been upstairs yet so I don't here we go I'll show y'all outside later all right, y'all, I'm trying to get my life together. Your girl gonna get this vlogging down. But anyway, so we're here. I think what I'm gonna do first is to put my stuff upstairs and then I'm gonna come back and get y'all to it. So, yeah. All right, y'all, so I picked my room. This is like a cottage. It's like, it seemed like it was an older home and then they renovated it. So this is my room. Mm-hmm. And then you got these stairs that are very steep. And this is a small little foyer area. All right, and then here is the bathroom. Yep. Amen got here earlier than everybody. We're still waiting on one more person, Stacia, who actually kind of put this together. But yeah, so this is the bathroom. Yeah, it looks like they. this was an older home and they renovated it and then this is the other bedroom say she's yours girl when i saw these steps coming down in here i was like oh no ma'am because i got to already walk up some steps and then come back so this is the other room okay i thought about this one and i said no i don't want to walk up and down steps to get out the room so then you go down these creaky steps <laughs> are steep all right this is the living room area now a little fireplace the kitchen okay 
Okay. That's Amen, guys. Did you see the other bathroom? I didn't. It's, no. right, it's right here. Yeah, it's right there by the TV. That was nice. Oh, girl, I'm gonna have to come downstairs. You, I have room. Hold on, it's right here. Um, by the TV, yeah. Where the the giraffe is. Yeah. Oh, it's okay. Wow, it's like they must be made it into a bathroom because you would not expect. Hold on, where is it? I mean, give me find my light switch. Maybe it's like no. Yep, it's on the outside. Wow, yeah, this is nice. Yeah, it's like they they made this into a bathroom. Yeah, girl, I'm I'm using this bathroom. This one's giving hotel. It's giving hotel. I. I am a hotel girl myself. I did one other Airbnb and that was like, ooh, that was a, maybe a, a couple years ago. Yeah. And I took my daughter to the beach and like the pictures did not match the vibe when we got there. I was so uncomfortable. And I was, and I just hadn't been able to do one since. But I've had friends who rented, like went in on those really expensive houses. Like they can get really nice. But the really, really nice ones are really, really expensive. But you can tell this is a, like an older home and they renovated it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Sure. That's what it's giving. Yeah. Yes, yeah. To, um, yeah. I was like, first, he was like, I was like, girl, first come, first serve. Yeah. So. And I was like, hopefully, I, don't, I was like, because sometimes you're like, well, I, I'm the one who booked the Airbnb. Yeah, know. you just never know when you, don't, you ain't stayed overnight <laughs> yeah. with somebody before. Right, right. Yeah. I was I when I tell you I was like last minute packing I was like um what am I gonna put together I had to run out and figure something else out I already had like part of an outfit something never showed up it was just a lot going on so I was like I got a shirt from Amazon it was like this fire it was like a fire crop top it literally stopped halfway oh my it goodness. was given it was giving, I'm taking it back. It right. Was, <laughs> it's giving me Amazon returns. <laughs> yeah. So, I do have a friend that stay up here. And I know he be sick of me. Like, every time I come up here, I be like, um. I hear him like, hey, Tony, I'm on the way up. And he be, it's always a hit or miss. Because I be like, oh, I have some downtime. We can come. And then, last time, I got too lit. And I was like, I gotta catch you next time. So. Do you know any? club and stuff girl i don't be going last i haven't gone like out out in charlotte in a minute like i when i used to come up here i would go to like i don't do that the last time i was up here i went to that and went to art show we did end up going out but it was like one of those it looked like a regular neighborhood but it was a oh. bunch of clubs and stuff really? and it was yeah okay but it, it was like loungy type clubs so they had like uh -huh. the rooftop and but stuff like that, I gotta be able to sit down. Yeah, 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 yeah. If I can't sit down, I can't. I don't like not having a seat either. Right, yeah. I'm, the older that I get, I'm like. Yeah, no, yeah. Please, I need to be able to get to a seat, please. Please, me. <laughs> please and thank you. Yeah, so I don't really know. Because I don't. Last time I've been in here was like, yeah, I went out. Because my cousin's birthday. We, she did go to a club. But one of my cousins was real young. So she was knowing like all the places to go. But mm -hmm. child, I, I do not be out like that it's giving rooftop bar tonight yeah it's giving i'm gonna sit down but see i don't have nothing to wear tonight like i didn't even think to bring enough i just brought some jeans i brought i wasn't sure everybody because you know like you pack multiple outfits to be like, mm -hmm. five is on right so i brought um some jeans but then i, I also brought like a skirt and like because i almost was gonna go because i was like target closed at 10. I was gonna run, try to find a target, but the way I got to fight to get in out yes, this place, yes. I'm like, I don't want to go be going back and forth. Right. Like, it's all. It's yeah. The 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 placement of this house is not the best. Yeah. It's not, not the best placement. I feel like downstairs is the best. Upstairs is cool, but that bad. I got used to downstairs bathroom. I'm very weird. Like things have to look a certain uh -huh. way if it's not mine. Honestly. Yeah, if I see a hair I'm very on the bed, about Airbnb sometimes though, because you know how people say like, oh, you gotta make sure you check the check for cameras. And I'm like, ah, y'all gonna see me? Check for cameras. That's what I said. I said at this point, y'all. Y'all gonna? Cause I don't know where. I don't. Y'all about to see? 
all of me. So I'm gonna have to at this point. Cause yeah, it'll be the first and last time I'll be here. So <laughs> there you have it. <laughs> Pay me for it. Yeah, please. Yeah. At this point, yeah. So I don't know. I was like, I'll go back out and try to find something just in case we do something tonight. Mm -hmm. I gotta go, girl. I gotta find something for tonight. Like everything else is planned out for tomorrow afternoon if we do something tomorrow night. Yeah. So I don't wanna. Yeah. I have the two outfits that I got. So I was like, one of them's gonna get worn tonight, and one of them might get worn or. One of them might get one night, one of them will get one more. We'll see what the vibes on tomorrow. Yeah. Because I said we might be too tired to really want to do it. That's why it's like, or if we did something else, we might just go from where we're at instead of like, because if I come back, yeah. And I'm going to go to bed. Night, I, you, night, I, lights you out. You was already about to go to sleep. Lights like, to look, I'll see them when they get here. <laughs> yeah. Because one thing I'm going to open at midnight like what you playing for us look how huge this place is dang i hope they got a little story hey good morning y'all like i didn't even close out i wanted to feel more in target but it was a lot going on in there and they were approaching closing time so it is saturday i have up early i've been up since like five something I, we didn't end up going out last night. Like, we were really tired. Um, Stacia got here, like, after 11. So, it was kind of late, and, you know, everybody had a long day. So, we decided not to go out last night. Like, if they would have went out, I probably would have. I had tapped out. I literally sat downstairs when Stacia arrived, and I chatted with them for a little bit, and I was like, y'all, I got to go lay down. I don't know what time. I don't know what bed before midnight. But it had been a long day, so the um, festival, the Durag Festival is today. But it it starts at 2, so it's like from 2 p.m. to 10. I don't know what we're going to do uh, this morning because this is my first. Me and Stacia, like I have hung out before, she's the one who invited me. Amen, who y'all met yesterday. That was our first time meeting, like, yesterday. So, I don't really know, like, everybody's vibe or, you know, like, I know I be up. And I, like, get up early and I pray and I meditate most times or I journal. So, I was up. I, I did some guided meditation this morning. But, it even really hard for me to focus. <laughs> like, I was really pushing through that meditation. But I'm up. I'm about to go outside. I also want to see what it looks like because I got here at night. So I want to show y'all how it looks outside. So I'm, um, I think too first I'm going to lay all my stuff out because normally when I come stay somewhere, I lay all my stuff out so I know what I have, you know. So I think I'm about to lay all my stuff out first and then I'm going to walk outside so y'all can see what it looks like because I'm up. I'm not going to. I'm so excited. I'm not going to be able to go back to sleep right now. So, um, and I think, yeah, everybody else probably still knocked out, but I'll be up early. So, um, going to get my stuff together, like pull out what I'm wearing and stuff. And then, um, cause I got bags of clothes. I got stuff everywhere so I can see what I got, but, um, I'll let y'all see that.
move over because I don't know where what yeah I don't know where we okay yeah that's definitely interesting where you at Shadi? Where you at Shadi? So that's, that's the same that's, thing that happened with old girl. That that lady. That's exactly what happened with that lady who was acting the fool. Okay, we're actually at the parking garage. We parked on level one though. Are you the what the one by Cheesecake Factory? Cause I think Yeah, because oh. they got more than one. Oh. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Cause we um you had to pay for parking? Oh, oh, okay, 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 okay. I just wanted to pay attention. Okay. Wait, shit, okay. All right, y'all, so we we making a couple pit stops. We at the mall okay, right go. now, and we waiting for our home girl. And she got to get her outfit. Me and Amy already got something to wear, so me and Amy about to go bust down somebody's plate real quick. So hungry. It is about a little after 12, but I'm gonna try not to spend no money here because I'm gonna have to go shake something if I keep spending money at this rate. <laughs> <laughs> okay, were you close to where um, we are? Oh, yeah. I wanna see if I can find a parking shop, but I don't know. It was a lot on that row where, you, where we at. Oh, it's a bunch of open ones down there. Yeah, it's very fancy. This was the only mall I used to come to when I came to Charlotte all the time. I used to get it on my life. I guess it's I've been to another, like a regular mall here. I don't know what it was called, but yeah, this is the really nice one though. Yeah, I've yeah they have like the, the name brand, but you still, they still got like H&M and them kind of stores in here too, okay. so yeah. Girl, we gonna be cute. It's gonna come. It's gonna come together. You are gonna find something good in here. We need to look and see. Um, they got one of them things so you can see what stores they have. Girl, I um, I just stopped. Like when I was always, I just stopped wearing them. I just been doing mascara lately because I've been feeling like. I don't know because my head ball, it just be seeming like too much going on on my face. Yeah, I used to, to, yeah. Yeah, I, that's what I'm looking for too. <laughs> yeah, shout out to that food court. What kind of stores you like to shop in? It's so good to be with people on the same vibe. Y'all, yeah, you know, like when you have friends, like, you know, that they don't never know each other, out. and, and it's like, our first time meeting is living together for a couple nights. Yeah. Yep, that's why people don't vibe off that. I'm like naturally friendly with people, yeah. like, I'm gonna give you a chance. Yeah, some people come in cold, and I'm like, girl, yeah. why, why are you acting like that? Like, why? Now, I told her before, before we got there, like, like, cool, I'm like, she's awesome. Yeah, I didn't even know she was a Libra till today. Yeah. Yeah. Well, Brittany came in yesterday. 
I was about to go. I was just mad. I was, I was this close. To yeah, I got it way later. Than So we, we just left the liquor store and we done secured the package. We're headed back to the Airbnb. And now you about to see us transform. We about to like transform visually and mentally. Once I drink this tequila that Stacia said, this is the tequila, so we gonna see. We I gonna see. Turn left. I'm taking three shots for me. Ah, you better. I am. I'm taking three shots. She was saying she was gonna call us an Uber. Okay. Yeah, cause she, I, I was like, if we all gonna be getting lit, I think, yeah. yeah cause remember in the conversation see. I just had with you last, I was like, I'm not taking them penitentiary chances yeah. again. I don't, yeah, yeah. I, I'm okay with it. Yeah, okay. Yes, I'm okay with it. I'm okay with being everywhere because. Yeah, cause I'm like, being yeah, lit, I don't. Yeah, I wanna be able to not have to worry about, and especially in these um, streets, it's too many twists and turns for me. Um, that I'm a white claw. I can drive me a couple of white claws. I'ma pass oh. the exit 15 times if, if mm -mm. Yes, guys, don't drink and drive. We're being responsible and getting us a Uber. But we're leaving the mall now. We headed back to the house. And then once we get all cute and shit, I'm gonna hit y'all back up. Alright, just wanted to show y'all my fit real quick. We back at the house. We done made a trip to the liquor store, got all, so this, I got this skirt off of Amazon, and this little red crop top, it came from Target, the hat is from Amazon, my hair and bone is from H&M, earrings, beauty supply store, I got this ring from H&M, hold on, hand it away, got the ring from H&M, we have, this is a fit, it's a Durag Festival, so I wanted to be like cute, but I also wanted to like be cute and cash. And then shoes, hold on. Uh, Converse, can y'all see? I have some more full shots, but yep, this is a fit. Girl, I'm stepping out. My comfort zone, because mama got the crop top on. But yes, this is a fit. Real cute. I almost was about to wear shorts because I'm like, bruh, this skirt is very short. So, but it's like the shorts are too boring. I might try the shorts. Let me just try them. Okay. Ready to get this shit started. I'm excited. Yeah. It's a, 
Okay. It's a bad bitch party. Oh my god, hey, so just wanted to come on and close out the vlog. Oh my god, I'm so tired. So, but the last thing y'all saw was me at brunch. So we decided to go to brunch this morning. Yo, we had a night. Um, I'll probably have to do a story time. <laughs> so last night, yeah, it, it ended up being somewhat eventful. But um, I didn't really film much of that because we were out and it was a long day. So I was like tired of filming. But if y'all do want to know the tea, we had a very adventurous night. But anyway, so we ended up getting brunch. Um, we talked to the Airbnb host. <clears throat> And then um, he was like, we, our checkout was at 10, but he gave us an additional hour. Shout out to him. I'm going to make sure to remind uh, Stacia because she booked it. To, we got to leave him a really good review because that was clutch. We needed extra time this morning. So then um, we had brunch um, and then we went our separate ways. So I got back home. We were at brunch probably like around... 11 I probably got there pulled up like 11 15 so I we ate for we were there for about an hour I got on the road a lot after 12 and then I got home it was some traffic in certain areas so I got home a little after two o'clock but all in all it was the time went by so fast I had such a good time it went by fast um I just know the future because I it haven't I haven't been to like a festival in a long time but I would definitely recommend being hydrated. Please be hydrated, especially these summer festivals. You got to be hydrated. But I had a really good time. Actually met some really cool people and ran into some old friends that I've you know been meeting at different events. So it was really dope. Um, I would definitely go again next year. That was my first one. 
so I'll definitely know how to prepare better for it and uh yeah every like the energy of everybody was so good everybody was so uplifting it was a true true black experience it gave like homecoming but make it afropunk that's what it gave but yep so um my daughter is coming back from florida today there i know she uh, reached out to me at like around 12 and like they were leaving then and it takes about a 78 hour drive i don't know how many stops they're gonna make but she should be back sometime this evening. Evening, I'm assuming between seven and eight. So yeah, all in all was good. And I am going to continue to rest until um, I get the word that she's back. Because listen, mama uh, can't hang like she used to. And every time I get opportunities to like go out for real or do events, um, usually like with this, with me having so many days to myself, I really like hit the ground running. I literally was doing something every night when I think about it. Wednesday night, my my bestie that I hung out, that y'all saw me go to dinner with Amber, she came over Wednesday night. We, you know, just hung out at the house. Thursday night, you know, we went out, of course, as you saw. Friday, I had to get on the road to go to Charlotte. So, um, but we didn't do nothing Friday night. I wouldn't have been able to. And then Saturday was a full day for us. Um, so yeah, it was jam packed. So yeah, I'm probably gonna be, yeah, I, I'll be out of work tomorrow because I definitely need a day to like recruit, excuse me, recoup, especially when we're at home. Normally I'll be gonna do my groceries or all of that. And I, you know, this was like a good week for me to have a break from having to do all the grocery shopping because I was here by myself and I was barely here. So yeah, the time went by really fast. But what I did realize with this is that. I definitely wait too long and I was talking to Amen about that like and she was saying the same thing like we definitely wait too long sometimes to do something nice for ourselves or to be intentional about like doing something so like I know a lot of times my my excuses are oh I don't have a sitter I don't have a sitter I'm gonna stop saying that like yeah sometime ideally I'm I probably am not gonna always get this many days to myself and I get that. But I at least need to plan. I said I'm going to start at least one weekend a month. One weekend a month. I'm going to shoot for two weekends a month. But at least one weekend a month. I need it needs, I need some time dedicated to myself. Not even necessarily like for going out. But just I love. I love doing stuff on myself. Um, So just to carve out some time, you know, to, to catch up with a friend or friends or just really be intentional. As um, far as making time for myself, I definitely want to make more time for myself. Like I said, even if I just get somebody to watch her for the day, for me to go get my nails done or just go to a museum or just do some solo activity, you know, it don't always have to be an overnight thing. So, yeah, um, my goal is like at least two weekends a month. And if I can't get a weekend... In a full weekend, at least get like a day or, you know, get a sitter for like a few hours just to get out. Because we both need it. Like, sh your, you know, your children, I feel like they need time away from you just as much as you need that time for yourself too. They need time to, um, I think it really helps. Like, this is just my opinion. My daughter is very, very sociable. She's like, everybody's around her. They like, like, she comes in a room. She likes the room. She likes to be with a lot of people she likes to have a lot of people around and like I can't always provide that because I'm a single mother because we don't I don't have family here you know her father's family's here but like far as the how like I grew up with a lot of cousins around I grew up with a lot of family around like and things have changed so much since now that I'm a parent um you know even when I was still back home we didn't have all of that like a bunch she don't have all that like, but she gets it from her father's side. Like, he has a much bigger family. She got more cousins her age. And, you know, so I'm really going to try to do better about making sure she gets that time as well. Because she, we need that time. Everybody, I feel like, needs time. Whether you're, especially if you're, a, whether you're a parent or not. But especially if you're a parent, whether you're a single parent like me. Whether you have a husband, you have a partner, whatever. Like, everybody needs time. And I feel like even even more when you have a partner, I think it's great to do things with your partner. Even though I'm single, but I still like whenever I get into my next relationship, I want to make sure that, yeah, I love spending time with whoever I'm with. 
But I want to make sure that we still have time outside of each other. Um, I think that's important to still have that. Everybody needs time to themselves or time to spend with friends outside of y'all mutual friend group or whatever the case may be. But anyway, I just wanted to close this vlog out. If you made it to this point, thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for... You are a part of me starting my YouTube journey again. So, like, I feel like any new chance you get to start, any new day, any new opportunity, just start. So, like, I'm just starting over. And I will, will be seeing a lot more of you guys. Y'all will be seeing a lot more of me. Please comment, engage. Um, I love feedback. Um, constructive feedback, of course. But yeah, if you made it to this point and you made it to the end, thank you so much for watching. Um, my goal is to be dropping weekly. Y'all try to hold me accountable. I'm doing my best to drop weekly. I'm not going to use excuse like, oh, I didn't have anything going on. So, because I think that's a common thing. But I thought this was a great week to start vlogging because I had all this free time and I had all these things going on. But it's not always going to be this way. But I, you know... I'm going to do my best to stay as authentic as I can and transparent with y'all. And yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on the next one. You know I hate